What's up, everybody? Crazy Mike D back again to do another hot sauce review. And today's hot sauce comes uh, from a friend, um, Dylan Keenan. He had sent me a bunch of hot sauces um, from his hot sauce shop. It's called Heat Hot Sauce Shop. Um, definitely check them out. And this uh, sauce is actually pretty cool. I like how it's packaged. They're just sample packages, I think. Um, but I like them because they're great to travel with. They are the uh, they come from Palo Alto Firefighters, and this is the double XL habanero hot sauce or pepper sauce, sorry. Um, but yeah, I think that is really cool how they have them. Little travel size, awesome if you're going to be going out for lunch or supper or something, and you don't want to bring a whole bottle of hot sauce with you. Because, you know, in a lot of restaurants, they don't carry really good hot sauces. So, you know, you throw one of these in your pocket, you're good to go. Um, really cool. Really cool uh, packaging. They do have full-size bottles, and I think they do have gallon uh, gallon size bottles, too. So, definitely check them out. The link will be in the description below. So, uh, yeah. In the ingredients, we have red jalapeno peppers. Habanero, pep, uh, habanero peppers, water, distilled vinegar, sugar, paprika, spice, and xanthium gum. Pretty simple hot sauce. I, I also love this. There's a little tag you probably can't really see. No. Or maybe a little, little, kind of like a little cut in it. Makes it very easy to open. So we're going to open this, try to, hmm, there we go, hmm, got a little bit of plastic with there, that's okay, we're going to get the aroma, now, it's a little, dang, plastic, stay now, let's get the aroma and see how it is, ooh, I like that. Hmm, I'm smelling cumin, like the uh, that taco uh, aroma, like a nice taco hot sauce or taco uh, salsa, something like that. I'm not too sure. It doesn't say it has cumin, it just has spices, but cumin is a spice, is it not? Hmm, wow, definitely smell, definitely smelling cumin. We are going to put this on the spoon, even though this isn't a, a full tablespoon, I don't think. So we'll get this on here. Nice bright red color. Oh, it might be a tablespoon. Whoop, whoop. We're dripping a little. We have a little bit of spill. We don't want that. It's okay. That's fine. So we're going to rate this on a 0 to 10 on heat and flavor. So here we go. Ooh. I like that. There's little bits. I think that's little bits of, of pepper in there. Just little. Not really that chunky. You have a couple of drops behind my laptop here. Hmm. Don't want to waste any. Oh, that's good. That's really good, man. Um. Wow. I believe the owner, his name is Eric Taylor. Dude, this is good. This is really, really, really good. Hmm. That's another thing I like about these. You can get every little drop out. Oh, wow. That is excellent, man. Heat on that one. Hmm. Barely any heat. It's got a good little kick to it, but it's not crazy hot. I also have the original um, Palo Alto. Not the double XX, like this one. 
Um, they do believe that they have the ghost, the double X ghost. Really want to try that one. Wow, that is good. I like it. I really, really like it. Um, for a simple hot sauce like this one, that's really good. It definitely taste the paprika, the taste of vinegar, but it's not overpowering. The taste of red uh, jalapenos, really good uh, flavor of the red jalapenos. A little bit of the habanero flavor. Um, I would like to see more of the habaneros in this, but otherwise, it's it's excellent sauce. Um, A little bit of sweet from that that sugar, um, but it's not overly sweet. Sometimes they when they put sugar in it, it's it's over too much sugar and it's just overly sweet. But this has got a great great sweetness to it, perfect sweetness to it, perfectly seasoned. Um, but yeah, the only thing I could say that I would like to see in this sauce a little more is a little bit more uh, habaneros. Not much, not much, but just just a little bit. Um, wow. Heat, you know, it's, it's barely good for me. I'm a chili head, barely any heat, but excellent flavor. Heat, I'm gonna give that, I'm gonna give that a one on heat. Flavor though, I'm giving that a nine. That is excellent. I would love to have a full size bottle of that one. I'd actually like to have a full size bottle of all of them, really, but saying that, I would love to get myself a full size bottle of that. That would go fast. That would really go fast. I know the, the original, um, if it tastes similar, but has a milder flavor, the original is gonna would go in a few days. No problem. Yeah, great sauce. Link will be in the description of where you can buy some. Uh, definitely get yourself some if uh, if you're looking for for a, a hot sauce that's not too hot. If you're not a, an extreme chili head, but you like a good uh, flavored hot sauce, definitely get yourself some of that. Ooh, excuse me, uh, because it's not crazy hot. It has just a little bit of kick, and then it's gone. Like right now, that the heat is completely gone, um, but I still have a little bit of a lingering of the flavor. Um, excellent flavor. The only thing I can say um, that I would like to see changed in it is a little bit more habaneros. Uh, but other than that, perfect. Keep it as it is. Great sauce, good, uh, man. Really good sauce, Eric. Uh, definitely get yourself some link up in the description like I said three times <laughs> But uh, yeah Awesome awesome stuff really love it. Uh, thank you Dylan for sending me this Really enjoy it. I'm looking forward to try the other Palo Alto the original Hopefully in the future. I'll be able to try the, the ghost too and uh, Yeah We'll see you about that Hopefully you enjoyed this video if you have Hit that like button, comment, subscribe, share. As always, this is Crazy Mike D signing off. You guys have a great day. Take it easy and keep on saucing.